Welcome to Smart Yard Test Maneuvers Tutorial brought to you by Galadari Motor Driving Center. The Smart Yard Test is one of the main requirements for the RTA to obtain a driving license and it consists of several maneuvers as following. 1. The Hill 2. Emergency Braking 3. The Angle Parking 60 degree 4. The Vertical Parking Garage 90 degree 5. The Parallel Parking This video will help you in clarifying the detailed requirements for training and testing on Smart Yard maneuvers and to avoid the accidents. You need to know the procedures that you must follow before starting the test, which are 1. Attend to the test counter 15 minutes before the time mentioned in the message. Otherwise, you will be considered as absent and you will have to pay a new fee to obtain a new appointment. 2. Follow the examiner's instructions. 3. Please dress modestly. 4. At start point and before move off, you need to adjust the side mirrors to see traffic at the rear, not only see the ground. You need to follow precautionary measures to limit the spread of coronavirus, COVID-19 maintaining the social distancing distance, two meters, wearing a face mask, use the sterilizers available in the center. Let us learn about the hill maneuver. The total time of the maneuver is 90 seconds only. You will be considered failed the hill maneuver when found reversing more than 30 centimeters after the start of the test. After the engine speed, RPM, indicates more than 3000, the engine will immediately turn off automatically and thus this will cause the vehicle to return to the backward, causing a great danger that may lead to accidents so you have to follow the below instructions to avoid this. 1. Stopping the vehicle by raising the handbrake immediately and avoid using the footbrake. 2. Engage the gear to N or P. 3. Switch on the car engine. 4. Follow the yard inspector instructions. Let us learn about emergency braking maneuver. The total time of the maneuver is 90 seconds only. Increase the speed to reach the required speed from 20 to 30 steadily and gradually and do not look down. Do not use the brakes after hearing to the instructions issued by the device until you hear the beep from the device. If the beep do not come on, apply brakes when vehicle is at first broken line, which is 5 meters from entry line. Sometimes the beep comes very late. Let us learn about the angle parking maneuver. The total time of the maneuver is two minutes only. The actual time for performing the maneuver begins after using the right indicator before entering the parking. You will be considered failed in maneuvering for using the handbrake while entering the parking or not using the handbrake after stopping the vehicle in the parking. First, engage the reverse gear, R, to reverse it before starting. Follow safety measures and use the indicators before starting the parking exit process. Let us learn about the vertical parking maneuver. The total time of the maneuver is three minutes only. You will be considered failed in maneuvering when using the handbrake while entering the parking or not using the handbrake after stopping the vehicle in the parking. The actual time for performing the maneuver begins after using the reverse gear, R, before entering the parking. You have the right to use an additional maneuver to modify the vehicle, but before more than half of the vehicle enters the parking, then two points will be calculated. In all reversing, you must turn your body and look behind to ensure no vehicle and obstruction.
Let us learn about parallel parking maneuver. The total time of the maneuver is five minutes only. You will be considered failed in maneuvering when using the handbrake while entering the parking or not using the handbrake after stopping the vehicle in the parking. The actual time for performing the maneuver begins after using the reverse gear, R, before entering the parking. Two points will be calculated while entering the parking if you do not look at the left shoulder before turning the steering to the right. Finally, these are the most important immediate failure mistakes you should always avoid. Speed limit exceeded 34 km per hour. Do not fasten the seat belt or open the belt before the end of the test. Turn off the engine for three or more times. Open the door of the vehicle before the examination is completed. Exceeded the maximum time limit for the test, estimated at 20 minutes. You will be considered failed in your last maneuver after the vehicle was stopped at the end of the test in the following cases. 1. Opening the vehicle door after putting the gear into neutral after stopping the vehicle at the end of the test parking. 2. Turning off the engine before opening the door and after stopping the vehicle at the end of test parking. 3. Not raising the handbrake after stopping the vehicle at the end of test parking. All the best to your Smart Yard test.